we're with one of the big names here, uh, Joe. Uh, good to see you, sir. Good to see you, Rob. Um, obviously, you're, you're a big name around here with regard to uh, Jim Weir, uh, and I appreciate you taking the time to talk with us. Absolutely. Um, we're, we're out there talking to folks about um, what we're doing in this space, so to start with, maybe just introduce yourself and the role that you have. Uh, sure. Sure. Uh, Joe Duncan, I am with Champlain Water District. I'm the general manager there. We're a wholesale drinking water supplier to about 80,000 people in Chittenden County. Uh, when you think about your daily activities or even maybe some of the history in this space, what's one of the things that's most interesting about working in Uh To me, it's, it's knowing that you're providing a service to people that they can't live without. I mean, drinking water, this is the field that Champlain Water District is in, um, and you cannot live without water. Basically, uh, you don't understand the value of water until you don't have it. And so I, I really enjoy being able to provide that and knowing that at the end of the day, that's, uh, that's my role in society. Uh, so we think about the younger generation trying to get more people involved in this field, whether it's water, wastewater, stormwater. Um, what would you say to encourage someone who's maybe considering what they want to do with their career um, to enter this space? Uh, great question. You know, and I, I look at it uh, through my lens, which is basically, you know, when you when you stop and think about all the different professions that are out there and the different fields that you can get yourself into, um, being working in a community, uh, helping the community uh, thrive, as well as a lot of technical challenges that are in this field that need to be solved. There's a lot of problem solving that's out there, a lot of hands-on that work that needs to be done. And so, you know, if you're the type of person that enjoys challenges, enjoys being out in the field, enjoys a, a, a hands-on approach to, to work, uh, the, the drinking water field and as well as the wastewater and the stormwater field are great fields to be in and encourage anybody to be in that. But also too, you know, people I think are realizing that they want to have some meaning in their profession. And there's nothing more meaningful than, than providing water quality to communities. Great. So, final question for you. Shifting over to, to Jim Weir, obviously you're heavily involved in the organization. Um, what would you say to folks who are considering maybe pursuing membership or, or being more actively involved in this group? Yeah, well, uh, one thing I, I love about this profession as well is it's a very social group, a very welcoming group. And what Gimwea does is it brings those entities together, especially at a show like this at our, at our fall trade show, to network um, and also to learn from each other. I, we live in a, in a profession where people want to help the other person. So being involved in Gimwea gives you that opportunity to make those connections, whether they're personal or professional. Uh, I, whenever I've had a need, I've always looked to somebody that I've met with in Gimwea to help me out. Um, so there's incredible value there. As well as in this profession, you need to keep up with the technology, uh, the, the rules, the regulations. And Gimwea provides those opportunities, trade shows and networking events, to, to understand what the changing landscape is in the water world. So, and we have provided incredible value in that. Awesome. Well, Joe, I appreciate the comments, man. Uh, big thanks from Joanna and myself. And uh, looking forward to the rest of the show. Great. Hey, really appreciate the opportunity. Thanks, folks.